there, and welcome to the exciting world of hip. Good morning. I'm Andrea Jackson with your wake-up call for Friday, February 4th, 2011. All it took is one Molotov cocktail, and Cairo is in major meltdown mode. No one is safe from the violence, not even the reporters trying to cover the story. President Mubarak is expected to exit stage left today. Federal Reserve Chair and resident party pooper Ben Bernanke thinks it will be years before the job market returns to normal. All right. Uh, Andy Pettit, done being a Yankee. At age 38, he has decided it is time to retire. Nice. Uh, he will make the official announcement today. For those of you keeping score at home, flight cancellations have hit the 16,000 mark since Monday, thanks to the blizzard of 2011. Charles Manson was caught hiding a mobile phone in his prison cell. No word on who he was calling or texting. A prison guard is likely responsible for the mobile phone gift. The guy responsible for the Bellagio heist has been caught, busted in a sting operation trying to cash those $25,000 chips. The 29-year-old happens to be the son of a city judge and was a guest at the hotel. New in theaters, the scuba fright flick Sanctum and The Roommate starring Leighton Meester and Derek Jeter's fiance Minka Kelly. And the New York Post is reporting a madam named Felony. Yes, a madam named Felony in charge of sending hookers to Charlie Sheen's blizzard of 2011 party told her girls to hide the cocaine before the paramedics showed up. Now that's what I call customer service. Your San Diego forecast, sunny and windy, highs in the 60s. That is your Friday morning wake-up call. I'm Andrea Jackson. I'll ring you in the morning.